Today we're hearing from local health officials about a rare illness popping up among kids that might be tied to COVID-19. Amy Steigerwald breaking down what parents need to know about signs and symptoms. A disease among children which has a possible link to coronavirus is raising concerns among doctors and health officials. The inflammatory illness known as pediatric multisystem inflammatory syndrome resembles Kawasaki's disease and toxic shock syndrome. Now, even though there are no confirmed cases of this in Lucas County or anywhere in Northwest Ohio, the health commissioner still wants parents to be aware of this disease. Most children with the syndrome have either tested positive for coronavirus or for antibodies to the virus, which suggests they were infected earlier and recovered. It could be a combination of symptoms of the, ch of the child, abdominal pain, uh, diarrhea, uh, red eyes, rash, swollen hands and feet, difficulty breathing. So that there's a, a number of, of possible symptoms out there. So far, 85 cases have been diagnosed in children in the United States, some of which have popped up in Cleveland. The health commissioner says they need parents to pay attention to these symptoms and call their child's pediatrician if they notice something is wrong. Experts say since the pandemic started, many people are ignoring serious health issues in themselves and their children because they are afraid to go to a hospital. While it's good to have caution, ignoring a serious problem is not recommended. Don't be afraid to contact your doctor um, and or go to the go to the hospital if you need to. Again, call ahead. In downtown Toledo, Amy Stoggerwald, WTOL 11.